the girl. Gun it. Okay, yeah, the same thing. I lay back and get on the passenger seat. It's weird sitting on the side of the car. But my stomach's been feeling off for a while, and I just can't drive. And so I handed my keys over to this stranger. What's the worst that, that could happen, right? Holy shit. I stare out the window watching the unchanging scenery whiz by. Okay, so this, she didn't trust us at all. There's an awkward silence, but I don't feel like feeling it. It's so stuffy in the car. I reach out for the window control button and let the window roll open. Yeah, it's actually her side. You sure that's a good idea? It's not like zombies are just gonna throw to hurl themselves at a moving car. Well, who knows, maybe they would. Fair enough. The slight breeze feels so, so good against my neck. But this guy looks like he wants to say something. Okay, she noticed. So I guess it's kind of strange to be asking after the whole days, but... What's your name anyway? Right, we never did introduce ourselves. It's... Shelby. Ah, I'm just gonna keep their name. Doesn't really matter. Shelby. You're all nice. Nice to officially meet you. The name Selby's my name is Dustin. Dustin. Okay. They never just they never said our name anyway. He looks dissatisfied. How was I expect much to react? It's not like I really care, but somehow he doesn't look very much like Dustin. I continue staring out the window. The sky is so red. Normally I think it was pretty, but it's it's pressing me. Bad things come after dark. I remember that too, all too well. I did not think about that, so I decided to break the silence after all. So, what are you doing here before everything happened? Huh? Oh? He looks surprised. I guess I haven't been talking much since we met. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. You know, this and that. I never really settled this one thing in particular. What does that mean? That was weird. Whatever. Whatever, it's not like it, I actually care, I just wanted to pass time. What about you? The ride is yours, right? Yeah, well, it's really my dad's car, or it was. Even when he was alive, through it, I was the only one who drove it. After dad got on that third disc, this is last one was revoked. Uh, so we get to see more about her dad. See? <laughs> he used that as an excuse to never leave the house. Oh, wow, what a faggot. That's a really bad dad, holy shit. It was just, well, anyway, sometimes he'd leave the car somewhere and forget. How can you forget where your car is? That's very bad. Man, a car is expensive. How can you just... Damn. I guess he didn't. Sorry, never mind. I'm feeling surprisingly calm about this. It's like I'm on the outside of looking in. I wonder if I'm really that college. Maybe that college is giving me more perspective. It's okay, the booze would have killed him eventually anyway. Yeah, was... Pretty quiet in here, huh? Yeah, I take a hint already. Holy shit! Surprising, not much to us at the end of the world. Still, do you think there's any radio station left? I'd be pretty shocked if so. I reckon it could hurt to look through. I reach towards the console and turn the radio in one direction. There's nothing but static, sometimes when it's screeching. Great. Hang on a sec, go back down. Huh? What did he hear of exactly? This couldn't be real by something. There could be there. I slowly rotate the knob back the other way and wait. There is it, I think. Is that Marachi? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I can not believe. Out of all the music that could be playing this week, this is what we get. What am I thinking? Of course it is. Of course we're in the highway to hell in the dark, Marachi. The only music available to us. The combination of Spanish vocals and horns and track are completely ridiculous right now. I'm actually dying. <laughs> Tons of fabulous men were actually killing me. This is not what I was expecting. Who the hell out running this? Of all the music that would be left, man. It takes me a minute to settle down, but then... Wait, isn't that so the same song again? Yeah, it's probably an endless loop because it wouldn't... Typical. Sure, it seems that way. Guess it's different goals on the ways after all. And the undead aren't exactly interested in DJing. 
What would you think Zombie even listened to? Death Metal to obvious announcer? Rob Zombie or maybe they'll just Baby Metal these days? I don't know, I think a Grateful Dead seems more that. You know, it's always wondered this is what you're grateful for exactly. Remember they finally found themselves some peace. Peace, huh? Which they let the rest of us um, have. Ain't so bad right now anyway. Well, except for that. He's gestures towards the console. Well, now he's in the loop, marching the red station. So, what are you into anyway? Music-wise, it's like, more this top 40s. Not like a lot of free time to split music taste or anything. You, yeah, because you always work. You, Angel, tell me it's baby metal. Will you judge me if I actually say I haven't heard of them? No, that's my be for the best. He doesn't, he doesn't know, he doesn't have to know that I ironically like baby metal. Oh, he, he, she likes it. What do you listen then? Most people look at me and expect me to be into Stones of Marley or something, but will you probably actually judge me for more for this? Haha, <laughs> try me. At the. Oh my god, I can't keep a straight face. <laughs> I lose it. Everything is just too much. It's too kind and silly. I'm sorry, Justin, but not that I'm sorry. I told you. Nah, it's fine. The music's catchy. I managed to get these words out. All these laughing is making my stomach hurt more. Damn it. I mean, my parents listen to Ella, but it's fine. Your parents? Yeesh. How old are you anyway? You seem a bit young for Ella's. How old are you? Do you think I am? I'm pretty sure that you're the right answer to that question. Except for that one. I'm 22. Hmm. What kind of reaction is that? No, whoa, you look so young, or anything like that? <laughs> That's what she was thinking! Wonder how old Dustin is anyway. Oh yeah, he never said it, right? He seemed pretty old though. This music is kinda similar to ABBA, isn't it? All peppy and stuff? You should be happier to have it. I'm sure often is sick on it. Alright, enough of you. He probably reaches out into the radio. Heh, <laughs> he got this surprisingly immature, immature side of him too. Did you ever expect things to end up this way? What? Where did that come from all of a sudden? Pause. Oh, so yeah, you can like, same thing for the other episode, but she didn't answer the question. She, she did that, she chose that. Why did I have to ruin the mood like that? It's getting dark, huh? The sunset is still in the summer. And my best thought we still have any light that up. Yeah, and her, he's thinking about how I avoided the question right now. That's so cool. Especially without the street lights and all. It's like the sky of having it up. Looks a bit like a dying fire. It sounds kind of morbid, but kind of fitting for the end of the world. It's silent again for a little while, but it doesn't last. So you never really told me what is it that you do. I mean, it doesn't have to be a job or anything, but well, hmm. What do you think you like? What do you did before everything? Like to do, huh? Turn my eyes in the window as I think of my life. Actually, I worked it a lot. I didn't really have too much time for myself. Shower, go to work, have lunch break, and back to work, get back and watch. And it's passing, and then the whole thing will start again. That's about it. And after leading such boring life, I ended up here. I'm probably not gonna go out with a bang. My death is going to be just a dull as in my life. Holy shit! I guess that's most people's story. It's tough that it's tough, probably tough for now. All kind of pointless in the end. You wrote the demo for nothing. Just wonder if you spend your time better, you know? That's deep. You just sound cool. That's deep. That's actually exactly how I felt about it, too. I'm surprised I'm actually able to relate to him. Yeah, but I guess it doesn't matter either way. Zombies don't care whether you're a good or bad person. We're going to die anyway. So what about you? I'm sure you did not spend all your time listening to ABBA. I used to travel a lot, work and stuff, Nomad. Did he backpack across the Europe or something? What does Nomad mean in this context? <laughs> well, whatever. This sounds really cliche. Not really, it sort of suits you. To tell the truth, I haven't had much proposed knowledge of big getting by. Dark places with a poor vacation in my life. I guess I'm they got my wish in life. I used to wish for that too. I wanted to be free. I didn't want to be have responsible for my dad anymore. And now I'm not, but I can say whether it's really a good thing or not. Wish never do come true in the way you expect them, huh? Yeah, monkey, paw. My stomach starts to throw painfully. I look down and I press my hand against it. It felt okay for a while, but it's get acting up again. God, why did I... Why 
did all this happen? So I feel nauseous. Yep. Hmm? Damn, I shouldn't be so obvious about it. I don't want to cause any trouble. This might be causing even more trouble though. Oh yeah, it's gotten a little better, but I moved my hand from my stomach. It's not like arresting my hand there will make the pain go away. In a way, as long as I feel the pain, I know I'm still alive. There was more bit of hell. What's wrong with me? I'm just exhausted, which doesn't help things. You don't know how it, this is. You think we should rest up and rest? And glance at the fuel gauge on... Okay, sh we barely have... Okay, she checked the gas thing too. Nah, it's like it we're we'll be stopping soon anyway. Breaking would be a waste of gas. Onward it is then. Trying to ignore my pain, I keep my eyes on the endless world tree out ahead of us. It really hurts now. I don't think I've ever been in this much pain in my life. And they're saying a lot considering what I have to go through every month. It deserves this, don't I? I should feel bad about it. But what's her pain? I brought it on myself. Do you ever wonder, like, why us? Why, why didn't we make it so far? Good to stay alive. For a moment, I swing that baseball bat. I sealed my own fate. Just as I start singing the really dark thoughts, I hear Dustin's voice. Word. Yeah, well, that's his the thing he said you know i didn't believe that at first i mean basically the same thing and then i couldn't ignore it anymore and dad how do i even begin to explain listen you don't gotta answer me if you don't want to but your old man what happened my dad holy shit you killed him <laughs> You, you said you, you became a zombie. I smacked him in the head with a baseball bat and then ran like hell. Holy shit. Okay, that was a revelation. Holy snap. Wow. So he needed more beer, right? Of course he did. He was a deadbeat alcoholic. Yeah, she lied about that. Does it count as murder if you kill a zombie? Wait. No, it's not. Okay, so when he became a zombie, he killed her. He killed him. I think. That's pretty pathetic, huh? So was my dad. And so am I. In the end, I'm also doing better. My stomach is burning with the pain now and guilt. I stare out the window, seeing nothing but darkness. Who's there who can look out here? Two, it hasn't changed since way before, I guess. Oh! Hey, I didn't touch her hand, come on. I feel sudden warm in the top of my hand. That isn't at first, but then ready, steady. Dustin's hand rests upon mine. It feels somehow I flinch. I don't think I must use comfortable, but he means well, probably. We'll stay here, just remember that. Until that change, there's still time. Things might never get any better, stupid assume they would, but they're still breeding, that's her. That's pretty chest on it. Anyway, I'm sorry about that, about your dad, I mean. If you wouldn't get it, I must be hard losing it close to you. Wow, where do I even start? Be honest. For some reason, I feel like I can be honest with Dustin. Even though I barely know him, I trust him, somehow. My mouth opens all and own and words spill out. Honestly, I feel relieved when he died. And then I felt awful for feeling relieved. But I spent seven years of my life taking care of him. So, seven years, huh? In the end of it all, it just felt free. Not that I got to enjoy that feeling of freedom for long. It makes me feel like a monster to admit all this to someone else. It really does. But that's the truth. I wouldn't worry too much. There's no wrong to way to feel. He's right. I know that I'm only human, not a monster. Not yet, anyway. I guess I'm of his pleasure, no one cared. Okay, yeah, that's true. Still out there. Why is he still out there? I wonder if they were ever know. Dust and I. The guilt is really getting to me now. I have to say something. I. I am interrupted by the sound of it. Okay, she was about to say something. Now I pushed Mary's gas station, but now it's the end of the line, isn't it? I really thought the gas would last a little longer than that. About to happen. We bought this car after all. It cost us fitting. Fuel up, see? Yep. Too far. It'd be nice to sign up something. My stomach feels like it's on fire. I don't think I have much time left. 
Oh! I don't think I have much time left. You got infected? Hey, how fast do you think you can run? About an average, I guess. Do you reckon we should? I touched my stomach. The hole isn't ever going to heal over. She got shot! Yeah, she got shot. Somehow. This really is it. She's gonna die! Unless they found something. Find some healing shit. I don't know. I don't know if it, there's a point. Even if Dustin was an Olympic sprinter, I don't think you'd be able to make it. Not forever. If not me, then someone else would, Jeff. Maybe not. It's too damn dark anyhow. It's all this little fall, try upside and dust it up your face. Ha. Ah. He can crack a joke because he has no idea. Knowing that Jeff makes me feel like crap. Oh my gosh. I guess that joke didn't... I can't say anything now. Yeah, I would. You know, there's nothing we can do until the sunrise. Yes, we're crashing here tonight then. In more ways than one. It could be worse anyway. At least it smells what nice. Yeah. I close my eyes, feeling the trobing in my wound. I don't know how long it'll make and how long it will be able to go on. I wish I'm done more than work. Hmm? Funny. We've paid more attention than you. Go now for I can do the rest. I run far enough. Well, okay. good night then. The sunlight is completely extinguished. There's nothing more but darkness on the endless stretch of the land ahead. <sighs> so this was actually very nice. Wait a sec. Settings? Oh no. Return. Yeah. This was actually really nice. I would like to see what happens after this. The shadows that run along the side of a car. Well, that's the end for that. You can find this in Ichio. Wow, she fucking murked her dad. But I don't know if she was a zombie or not. Or if dad was a zombie or not. I'm not sure about that. Well, the other guy, he's a normal guy. I would say he's in his 40s. Doesn't look that old. At first, I thought he was in his 20s. But the way he was saying how young she was. Sounded like he was like in the 40s anyway. Or 50s, you can say. But he looks really young. Anyway, thanks for watching. And like always, stay cool. Man, this game is nice.